So hi, just a little update. And our products got the small refreshing. Probably you remember we had this latches here on this wall to latch it into place. Now you see on this newer version, we got rid of those. Instead, we have this locking mechanism uh, on the sides and it's a much nicer, a much more cleaner edges and also the handrail is nicely integrated. And what you, only what you need to do now to collapse this wall is turn this stently. This unlocks the latches in the corners and now you can pull it down. That's the one update. I will show another one outside. Another small update. We used to have for these walls that locked in place uh, magnets, but the magnets had some drawbacks. For example, when you operated in very high wind conditions, it tended that uh, those walls can come loose and uh, make the expanding a little bit of a hassle. Now we have those locks. So when it's in this position, locked, you see it's, I can shake it, it's firm in place. No wind can blow it shut, as it might was the case with the magnets. And now when I, I uh, want to collapse it, I just pull this lever, it comes loose and I can close it. And another new update is that also here in this position, it was used to be also uh, with magnets, but now when you come here, you can have a look. We have made here also another latching system, so it latches in place and it stays in place during transport, so secured very firmly. And when you want to release it, you just pull this cable and it releases and goes into place and locks here. Yeah, that's the update. One more thing, we added those removable plates. Those are in case you need to change the tire and need to access the tire, you can quite easily unscrew two screws here and then lift this away on both wheels can have the tire change. For tire chains it's okay actually to use the hydraulics leveling system as you see it, it's powerful enough to lift the whole trailer from the ground. Yeah that's another small feature in case hopefully you will never need it but in case you will need it you have this option. Uh, the new rolling units come with a new electrical layout or electrical grid. So you see we have always now two inputs, one, one time three, three phase and 400 volt and the simple 200 volt 16 ampere. And those you can switch. So when you have only the available one phase electrical connection, you can still use the whole systems, but then you have to be really careful of what you plug in that you don't overload the circuit breakers. But if you have three phase power connection available, you can just flip the switch inside in the switch box and you can use the yeah, full, full uh, equipment that you might want to intend to have two kilowatts in each, each phase or even more and you won't uh, burn the sockets. So that's another nice feature. So another small update is uh, we moved the uh, kill switch from inside this technical compartment to here to make it easier accessible to it so it's key easier to kill the power for the 12 volt system in a addition that was before but we have the lighting for the storage compartment and also in the technical compartment the lighting is available and what more we have always here an exterior power socket also so you can plug in your equipment that maybe needs to store here uh, we have used it like for connecting the starlink for example in this socket and we have another exterior socket when needed here on the back on one side and also on the other side Another thing, uh, this feature was always present uh, also in the previous videos, but we could, because we filmed the uh, previous videos in daylight, they were hardly visible. So here's once again, the trailer features uh, on all sides RGB lights. Uh, that's just that it looks nice. And, uh, and as it said RGB, so this means you can change the lightning color and you see they're all around the main entrance door. 
and also when you come to this side you see that this side is nicely lit on with the RGB lights and this one and especially if you do branding of your trailer for various brands you can easily match the color of the brand for example here let's do red or blue like the Maro brand or green if you do green energy stuff and you see that the LEDs continue also on this side one more thing all rolling units come standard with a fire extinguisher spare wheel uh, tools to change the tires and a toolbox also.